Jenna. Hi, Jenna. Um, today we are going to be talking about um, school buses. Okay. So, are they really safe? I fucking hate them. Okay. Yeah. Exactly. So basically, in high school, I took the bus. Okay. Okay. Um, there's no seatbelt. First of all. Okay. Second of all. You're getting on the bus with all these random kids. Now that it's COVID, it's like, okay, like, is it, like, I don't know, is it safe? Is it safe to have a bunch of kids in a tiny little tube? I don't know, but should they have seatbelts? That's my question. You know, it's funny you say that, because, like, you're right that they don't have seatbelts. You you think of all the precautions they take when the the kids are getting off the bus. It's like, it's not proportional, right? Exactly. I saw a TikTok of a school bus totally tip over, and I was like, what the fuck? It was so graphic. I'm like, no. why is this on my TikTok for your page? Should seatbelts be mandatory on a school bus? Well, here's the thing. I think, like, kids have, like, softer bones, right? So yeah. it's, like, kind of okay if they Okay, them. yeah, that's true. See, I never thought about that. <laughs> I don't know. I came on my TikTok yesterday. I'm like, okay, should kids have school... Oh, my God. Should kids have seatbelts on a school bus? Because they all tipped over and everybody was screaming. Well, they're, they've been doing online school for a while now, right? So, That's, like, okay, you yeah. just sit them at home forever. And true, they don't need to true, think about the seatbelts anymore. Now, let's talk about One Direction, okay? Okay. One Direction should not have broken up. Wait, bro- they broke up? They what? broke up what? a while what? ago. Like, how long ago? Like, I want to say, like, 2015, 2016. Yeah. No. Maybe 2016, like, Oh, shit, that's, like, five years ago, and you're still I know. upset. I went to the On the Road Again tour. It was, like, in 2016, so probably 2017. So did they end up going in separate directions then? They did. Harry Styles, definitely the most successful of them. I see. What is he they doing? They got into all this drama with Gigi Hadid. I don't even know. I guess they're not together anymore. But they're still all, like, musicians, or what? I think so, yeah. Gigi's a model, but, um... They're not Zane selling, is like, still TV ads? music. Liam Payne, he's doing his own thing. Niall Horn, I saw him on tour by himself. He was pretty good, but nobody compares to Harry Styles. Louis tries, but Louis just can't. You know what I mean? So maybe this Harry Styles guy is actually better off having broken up with the other Definitely. three clowns, right? So 100%. It's like the Jackson 5, right? Like, sure, yeah. they're good, but, like, there's that one guy who's, like... Michael Jackson. Yeah, there you go. Literally. So. King of pop. You don't get king of pop if you have Jackson 5, right? Anybody in the Windsor area, this Uber, best driver, man. Swear to God. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. You're so welcome. What else can we talk about? Whatever you want. Taylor Swift. Okay. If you were to choose Taylor Swift or Harry Styles, who would you choose? Like, to to bang or what? Like, what do you you mean? Who has better music? I have no idea. I've heard a few Taylor Swift songs. I don't think I've heard any Harry Harry Styles songs. But Taylor Swift has been my idol since I was fucking five, man. That, that can't she be good. She is talented with her lyrics. Like, she is so good at literature that she wins over Harry. And I love Harry. So, like, why does she, like, write about all these, like, breakups and shit? Like, I don't know. Does she not money. have different topics to talk about? Obviously like, not. She just makes money. I see. Yeah. Okay, well, right, well, we're here. Thanks a lot. See you later. See you Thank later. Thank you so much. No it's worries. Yeah, tons of fun. Take care, guys. You too. Bye. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night.